late, late at night, the world sleeps, and I am here alone. And here I come some nights to confront my fears. They're here, my fears. They are always with me, lurking, scurrying, hiding and waiting. They come, and they go. But though they are gone, they are never far. And here, alone at night, I can confront them. There they are, confronted fears! Fears of hunger, fears of pain, ow! Fears of missing the last train, fear of dentists always drilling, fear that no one will be willing to see me as I know I really am. But once they are counted and compelled, they can quickly be dispelled, Zip! like figments of my own imagination. But always there are other fears, fears of snakes, fears of cats, fears of maitre d's and rats, an irrational black terror that I someday may get fat, fear of elevators falling, and the tax man someday calling, and the accidental walling of myself up inside a clammy, dank, old, dingy cellar where the spiders weave around my tummy and the worms and bugs and crawly things squirm and squiggle at my person. Oh, I love it! <laughs> Once they are counted and compelled, they can quickly be dispelled. Zip. But then, there are other fears. Fear of bullets, there's a dread. Fear of baldness on the head. Fear of waking up one morning to discover that I'm dead? Once they're counted and compelled, they can quickly be dispelled, zip, like figments of my own imagination. Then there is the last fear, just about the time when I'm past fear. The one that really is final, it will come yours and mine -al. In the darkest of the night, it will come without a fight, it will count me and compel me, it will casually dispel me. Zzz. For I am but a figment of its own imagination. 